Yes, welcome back to Why in the Morning. Welcome back to Entrepreneurship Tuesday. My name is Barry Moses, or it's Barry Mokwam Tindawa Kijami. And yes, it's always a pleasure, as I always say. So special thanks to the people who are sending their feedback uh, where we posted a question on Facebook. And we asked, what is that business that you have seen, Yenyele Kubambasana, from how simple it is, but the execution is amazing and it brings uh, a certain amount of money. So we'd like to sample your feedback. And please remember our social media handles, uh, White54 channel on Twitter, White54 underscore channel on Instagram and right for four on Facebook hashtag is why in the morning hashtag, hashtag is entrepreneurship Tuesday uh, so let's uh, get to see what you guys had to say about this mm -hmm. so we have the first one from Samuel Ngugi and Asema Kayole in Ivasha present so there's a place in Kayole called Ivasha all right good to know Ogwell, Ogwell Jr. and Asema watching thank you very much for watching uh, Wa Nancy and Asema watching thank you very much for watching uh, Leyan uh, Mkarabati Guru Gwiji anasema in Leyan uh, Gram anasema hashtag one in the morning locked from Narok. The business idea by Imenibamba ni pidwak. Your business ni simple sana. You only need a few coins uh, for capital and some creativity and you're good to go. Since Nianze bidwak sijawa I regret. Hope one day you'll have me on the Entrepreneurship Tuesday show. I make bid ornaments thank you very much for sharing your feedback and uh, it will be a pleasure to have you on set to share your work uh one nancy Adesema, ever watching from kangema we love you so much for ever watching us uh then major rotation and sema manzena kuru locked kuuza uh, mahoods okay uh, it's interesting uh lit lit mass and asema lit mass kamakawa Kama Dawa, I'm enjoying the show. Nikiwa Kisumu, I'm an actor. I've tried lots of groups, but they do start and perish. How can I find them, please? So you're looking for a director or a group of actors you can work with. Uh -huh. We host so many on White by 4. We'll see what we can do for you. Chelsea Reddy, was Shamata, and I'm watching from Shamata. Uh, Leanne Graham, I see you've posted some of your beadworks, and it's quite interesting. They even have emojis on them. All right, this took uh, some work. We'll see what we can do for you, Le Le Leanne. Uh, we see your Instagram as well. We'll see what we can do for you. Uh, okay, Peter Teredo Anasema, hashtag 064. See hiya, Nico Locked. Show Ikopoa, I'm watching uh -huh. Thank you very much for the guys who have sent their feedback away. We have a special place in our hearts for you. Keep them coming on our social media on Facebook, White54. Hashtag is Y in the morning. Hashtag is Entrepreneurship Tuesday. Without much further ado, we have a guest in studio, our second entrepreneur of the day. And this guy, yes, graduated high school, got into film by chance, and then now is, in, is into the business of importing and selling. He goes by the name Steven Stone Karibusan. Yeah. I didn't mention you're a faster as well. You're a youth faster. <laughs> Karim Sada, yes, yes. your camera is number four. Yes. Uh, intro yako na credentials za kuzote. CEO, founder, <laughs> manager, faster, zote zikam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, my name is Steven. Uh -huh. Stevenson Maina Jenga. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Uh, I'm a youth pastor at Father's House. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm a missionary as well. And uh, I'm a businessman. I'm a gospel artist as well. So I have... Uh, I have, I have you have many wings. A lot of wings. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. I do a lot of things. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. And now you're the manager of NI Importers. NI Importers, yes. All right. Yeah. So we're going to be talking about NI Importers uh -huh. and uh, the business of uh, importing uh, mm. things into the country. And if yeah. it's a good thing, because uh, mm. some people might say uh, it's, it's not good to import. We should be exporting. Uh -huh. uh, but I'd like to know uh, where you're coming from. What is your, what is your background? My background, uh, I'm raised in... Uh, 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 an area called Ruiru, uh -huh. really just around Thika Road. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, so you've raised, seen Thika Road from a duo carriage to the super highway? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Raised uh -huh. by a single mother. Mm -hmm. We are two, I and my brother. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he deals, my brother deals with uh, transport. Uh -huh. So I was in the same, same field with my brother. After uh -huh. Form 4, I joined uh, transport. Mm -hmm. I used to be a Makanga. Uh -huh. Thika Road? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm taking um, this sand ya kuchenga, ya kujenga nyumba uh -huh. from Ukambani uh -huh. to Gidurai. Uh -huh. So I worked there for several years, though it was rough, uh -huh. tough for me. Uh -huh. yeah. Life on the road is tough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because and now it's very uh, hard labor. The, the yeah. cash you could be paid, uh, it's on trips. Uh -huh. Yeah, 
the trips you go mm-hmm. sasa zingine unakimbizana na mavijana na vijiko kule nyuma uh-huh. at least umwage ka, ka sanduku kamoja at least uh-huh. that you get 350 shillings uh-huh. Uh, uh, and then you get the salary uh, the trip uh-huh. uh, that is 500 oh, so ni pesa ya kando eh, yes eh, na sasa hiyo ni kubishana na mavijanaji kuna area yenye uwezi mwaga hiyo mchanga kuna ile area uwezi mwaga hiyo iko na wale wa wasewa hiyo area uwezi so cartel ziko kila mali <laughs> yeah, from utakuta, serikali <laughs> i don't know if you ever uh, come across those guys wakiona kirori kya mchanga wanakimbia na vijiko wanaruka uh-huh. yeah yeah so those areas you cannot work there So hiyo wow. itakuwa kazi yako ni donda kufungua milango alafu nyenyeke wakimaliza kazi funga milango walipe uh-huh. Yeah so I worked there several years uh-huh. and um, through music because uh-huh. I'm an artist I'm a songwriter uh-huh. so I did a song I went uh, recorded and then I got this guy who did my video uh-huh. still in YouTube but uh-huh. very very bad quality uh-huh. so I felt bad because I had paid uh-huh. na nile pesa ya kuchanga changa uh-huh. So I felt bad and I felt from like, kazi ya mchanga. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. nikasema now if these guys are taking us this this way. Uh-huh. They're doing poor qualities and uh, uh-huh. you've given your best audio. You've saved money. Yeah, and you've to saved the audio. You've yeah, saved yeah. money Dali to pay the director. Hiyo uh-huh. unge kakabiz manze kange grow. Uh-huh. So I felt bad and I decided that one day I would love to be a director uh-huh. and do good things and uh-huh. do quality stuffs. Uh-huh. And so uh, I met this guy who decided to manage me because he heard that I have a content uh-huh. in gospel music and so he was not that uh, packaged akwa uh-huh. na pesa pia uh-huh. so akakama kaniambia mi nataka ni ku support uh-huh. i see a vision and i also have a vision uh-huh. so i want to support you in a way that i can do you free videos uh-huh. but still the qualities were not that okay uh-huh. but we worked with him a uh-huh. point ninajipata singi kwa ile job uh-huh. yangu ya marori uh-huh. so tunachapa Uh, marut kando na yeye uh-huh. akiwa na wedding na shoot tunaenda na yeye uh-huh. akiwa nafanya music video tunaenda na yeye mimi ni mtu wa mkono uh-huh. ilikuwa time inafika tunaingia kwa ofisi ya kiedi tataki nikaribie uh-huh. kwa zataki ni learn uh-huh. but nilikuwa naingia tu naangalia saa zingine na kanyagia uh-huh. saa zingine naenda kwa laptop yake na chukua tutorials uh-huh. naenda home nilikuwa na ka desktop kalikuwa kana hang uh-huh. so unachapa chapa saa zingine kakikwama na lala asubuhi kalikuwa uki, ukitaka kukawasha utakawasha two hours before you <laughs> work with it so kakiamka <laughs> so kianza <laughs> kupika <laughs> sapa urasha <laughs> yeah and that is how so, we came to learn uh, videography one day we got a contract uh-huh. ya muhindi uh-huh. it was a wedding uh-huh. and it, uh, the wedding goes for about one week uh-huh. so yeah, we right. went camping there i uh-huh. met these guys from canada Mm-hmm. different guys from different areas uh-huh. and they came and then these guys had a big heart of helping mm-hmm. and so they trained me i got one who trained me videography mm-hmm. and that is how i became a video director wow so from there i started my company called unlimited films from scratch so unlimited films was yeah. birth of a yeah. coincidence yeah yeah but now kazi zenye nilikuwa napata ni za mazishi sana 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 mazishi 5000 ivo ivo doaries those uh-huh. events for doary weddings uh-huh. and then now i'm doing even music videos all right how much capital did you invest the first time I, in terms of getting equipment for equipment this? i was hiring uh, so but here 5000 najua 2500 is inenda kwa equipment uh-huh. and that was a, a, a good learning lesson because now today i'm importing those equipments uh-huh. and um Uh, because now you see these big directors most of them they don't have equipment uh-huh. some of them they live hand to mouth no walipa wanakula wengine they are doing free jobs uh-huh. or at least they get a name uh-huh. so they don't have equipment uh-huh. so i learned and i decided now i will be doing imports uh-huh. and then i be hiring these equipment and that Which is what I've been is doing. our topic of the day but mm-hmm. before we got into that importation mm-hmm. uh, part so ilifika uh, point uka buy equipment yako yeah ilifika what was point? the first thing that you bought uh, Nili, I bought a Canon camera. Mm-hmm. It was not of good quality but mm-hmm. that was a start. Then, yeah it was just a good start because I could do like uh, uh, some few things with it mm-hmm. and uh, and saa zingine najituma kwa makanisa mm-hmm. nafanya free jobs mm-hmm. na kuji market na kuji brand. Uh-huh. Yeah but I had strategy in my mind and I had vision that one day I'll be in a position to have these and these. I used to do research of the best quality cameras and all that. Uh-huh. So I knew that one day I'll be in a position to get them. Right. Yeah. 
So right now you have your own cameras. Yeah, yeah, no, uh, no, no, that you use no. for your yeah, film company. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you have equipment that you use to uh, that to you hire, hire yeah, yeah. out to people. Yeah, yeah. What are some of the equipment we can get from uh, as, a, as as a director? I have drone, mm -hmm. nice cameras, the 4K cameras. Mm -hmm. I have dollies, mm -hmm. lightings. Right. Yeah. And you have a warehouse that you store all these yeah, things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They send started with a dream, and yeah. now you have all these equipment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. All right. So after you got your own equipment, you started hiring out equipment from time to time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, at what point did you start importing, and how did you get into importation? Because there are so many laws that uh, that, uh, that 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 govern. Uh, the the mm -hmm. field of importation mm -hmm. uh, from licensing, from clearing and forwarding, mm -hmm. uh, from the fees that you need to pay uh, to the insurance that you need to pay uh, to the certifications that you need to get yeah, from sure. the other country. Mm -hmm. uh, a young man like you, Najoli mm -hmm. you are a young man, yeah. uh, a young man like you. How did you how, yeah. how did you go about all this to get into importation to get to this point that you hit? One thing in life is the cap capacity and the capability. Everybody is looking for that person who is capable of doing something. Mm -hmm. Money is not an issue. Mm -hmm. When you show up and you show people that there is something that is in you that you can do better and best, mm -hmm. everybody is interested in making money mm -hmm. from someone. Mm -hmm. And so if uh, I can say this, uh, there are people there outside who really waited to see someone who can come up with mm -hmm. an idea. Mm -hmm. And we all created with ideas. Mm -hmm. When uh, I can quote a scripture that says, Yes, Pastor. As he is, so we are. So mm -hmm. when God is the creator and the owner of the universe, that mm -hmm. means that he has everything. And mm -hmm. so when we are told that we are like him, mm -hmm. so that means that we have everything that we need. Uh -huh. And so There's a God in us. Yes, yes. And again, we just need to yeah. shoot it. Mm -hmm. and, again, and again, as scripture says that as a man thinketh, so he is. If you think you are poor, then absolutely you're poor. Mm -hmm. If you think that you're rich in your mind, it's you're rich here. because you have everything. You have all that you t it takes for mm -hmm. you to become a great person. And so I, I, I knew that around me there are people who have money. Mm -hmm. And one of them was one of my aunt who is in abroad. Mm -hmm. And when I look at the background of my family, we have mm -hmm. been, our family has been uh, in that place whereby you can say po poverty is Poverty is real. Uh, poverty is low. Yes, yes. You guys have struggled. Yes, yes. I've struggled even in the streets uh -huh. when I was young. Uh -huh. I've walked in the streets. Ni meuza machuma, ni meokota, ni mekata kata fence ya wase, ni kizaga machuma. So I know what is to struggle and I know what is to lack and what mm -hmm. is to have. Mm -hmm. And so I knew that if I, if the, these people, they, if they see me raising up, rising up and mm -hmm. they see that it, there is something that I'm doing, mm -hmm. they see that at least I've made a profile. Mm -hmm. They can see and they can, I can be a role model to mm -hmm. someone. Even if I approach anybody mm -hmm. from my family or from friends from the outside, mm -hmm. I can gain anything that I want. Mm -hmm. And so one thing is that people fear trying. Mm -hmm. But the minute you raise your standard and you make your profile become so positive towards mm -hmm. people's eyes, mm -hmm. you can achieve anything. So, so I have, image is very yeah, important. Image is very important. Right. So I had to approach one of my aunt who is in state. Mm -hmm. And I told her, I know there you're making your life. Mm -hmm. But still here, I'm struggling with some few things that you can help me with. Mm -hmm. So I think I have some few cash, mm -hmm. which I never had. Mm -hmm. But I want you to help me see how we can bring some few stuffs here mm -hmm. and do some resale. Mm -hmm. And uh, when I do the selling, I will give you back your money and mm -hmm. also give back your 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 interest. Mm -hmm. So it will not just come the way it's you a give. business. It's business. So you're part so, of the business as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm selling so, you an idea. So, so she, uh -huh. she asked me, now what do you want me to give you? I told him, I, I think if we do some household items, it can be good because zile fridge to nono kuni zamchinku. So when you to me a fridge, you to me a nini, you to me a vitu kada, and I try selling. Uh -huh. But my aim, uh, interest was to get some equipment for videography. But uh -huh. I could not go direct, because if I go direct, uh -huh. hey, labda haoni kayo ineza make sense. Yes, it has to Because I had tried, uh -huh. and I could ana sita sita anaanza kufikiria sasa nani wa media atanunua vitu kama hizi uh -huh. tena yeye ana ajui atatoa equipment hata ajui zinakaaje ajui uh -huh. kuangalia quality and all uh -huh. that so i knew that if i start with the household items it uh -huh. can be good so the first container came ilikuwa na ma fridge ma tv uh -huh. but very nice television the pioneers and all that uh -huh. and uh, some of the tvs i sold in churches uh -huh. and clubs uh -huh. because they were very big uh -huh. so i sold them and i showed the 
the potential in me. Uh -huh. I gave back the money. I never ate the money. Uh -huh. And it was a trial. Uh -huh. Because immediately after I've done that, now I could tell her, now I want cameras. Uh -huh. And I could send some pictures. Even he could send me some links to where I can I can do place the orders. Uh -huh. And, and just then go she and just pick. goes and picks them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But before, she could not do that. Uh -huh. so, so you had to prove she, yourself. Yes. She became very interested. Uh -huh. And uh, she sent one of the container, which took so long in clearing because now mm -hmm. this was my first uh, import, mm -hmm. and uh, I was never familiar with the ways where I can mm -hmm. get this, uh, where I can get this guy who can do the. So you were thrown in the deep end. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Now you know our country is very corrupt. Mm -hmm. So I never had that money that I can go to a certain office in Mumbai, mm Shikai, -hmm. Kumi. But I had God in me mm -hmm. who had uh, first facilitated the idea. Mm -hmm. So I knew that you, God, you will lead me as I follow you. So mm -hmm. whatever is uh, on that way, I mm -hmm. know you have cleared and um, just pass. Mm -hmm. So I went. Uh, it took like about three months to clear the container. It was 20 feet. Mm -hmm. It came. I sold it online. Mm -hmm. I, it was not about walking, but I had a shop. Mm -hmm. So I sold it online. And uh, sometimes utakuta mtu anakuitisha kitu unampelekea tao kumbe ni conman. Uh -huh. Like uh, last week I sold a camera. I sent my guy to go and sell a camera. Uh -huh. But alipata medanganyo, mezungushu, mezungushu. 250,000 zikaenda hivyo. Camera ikaenda hivyo. So there are conmen there outside. I'm trying to follow the case with the CIDs uh -huh. because this is something that is happening to many businessmen there outside. Uh -huh. And so I sold the container online, the, the items online. Uh -huh. And uh, I made good money. And I was taken to another level whereby even I could buy a car for delivery. Uh -huh. Yes. From the interest that I made. Uh -huh. the, 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 the cash, the extra cash that the I made. The turnover of the business. Yeah, yeah. But so again, I had to approach the banks uh -huh. to give me some loan because I had told auntie that I have some cash. Uh -huh. So I had to get like around 250000 to uh -huh. show that I've at really, least, really raised some cash. At least cash. you have but something I, on Yeah, the but team. I knew that when this stuff comes in, I'll be in a position to pay the, the loan uh -huh. again get some interest but now when the container could take like three months mm -hmm. it was like risk taking because uh -huh. now i was afraid uh, i've been given like few months to pay the loan uh -huh. and now the container is stuck uh -huh. so i was afraid a bit afraid but all right so uh to be an importer i'm trying to understand you do you have to take a lot of trips to mombasa and back no, 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 no. Like now we're doing shipping. Uh -huh. So it is shipping from UK to, mm -hmm. to here. Mm -hmm. And then when it's done clearance here, you mm -hmm. get one truck to bring the stuffs and then takes back the container. Just that. Just that? Yes. So where do you get your stuff? In Embakasi? No, 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 no. Uh -huh. uh, the first one I did in Mombasa, I've done, this is the second one that I'm mm -hmm. clearing this week. Huh? Mm -hmm. The first one, um, it is from Mombasa. It came uh, from the port of Mombasa, mm -hmm. direct cleared in Mombasa. To Nairobi, mm -hmm. just direct the truck came direct to Kasarani. Comes direct yeah. to your warehouse. Yeah, yeah. And so you, you pay the the truck up to here, to and fro, coming and going back. All right. But now it has been eased because of the SGR. Now uh -huh. you can get them at Embakasi. All right. Yeah. So it's easier now to be an importer. Yeah, yeah. What are some of the requirements uh, to, to uh, for 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 an importer like you? What is the first thing the government is going to require from you? Uh, I think from the other side, they need some documents mm -hmm. whereby they have to regularize that whatever you're importing is uh, legal. Mm -hmm. And I think from there, you need to get the cash mm -hmm. and uh, all the carry and all that. Mm -hmm. And you have to pay taxes and all that. Mm -hmm. and just, uh, just that. The, the, guy, who's, the guy who's doing the clearance mm -hmm. is the guy who has a lot of work. You don't have a lot of work. You mm -hmm. just need to have money. If so you, you need money, an agent to clear your yes, stuff. Yes, yes, yes. All right. At this point of clearance, uh, clearing and forwarding, mm -hmm. uh, do we have, um, since you said we're living in a corrupt country, do, mm. do you sometimes need to be careful with these guys? Or it's a very well-regulated industry? It depends with your clearance guy how, uh -huh. how networked he is. Uh -huh. Because now if he knows these offices, he'll be in a position to go and talk and say this and this and that. Mm -hmm. But me, I've been believing in the power of prayers. Prayer so is been also very important. Prayer, yeah. Pushing. So it has not been uh, rough on me because when I pray, I know things are okay. Right. So even when I get a call that it's stuck, uh -huh. I tell them, no, don't worry. By tomorrow, things will be okay. And you believe. Yes. And it's this confidence that, br that has brought you this far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Apart from co uh, container kukwama kopota, I know this is something you say a lot of times, mm. and it's something con men say a lot of times, and mm. you get a lot of backlash mm. for it. Uh, apart from this, what are some of the other challenges that you face? 
um, lack of money. Lack capital, of money. Capital, capital is always. Because now container can you, come. You are then, never going to have enough capital. Yeah, ca container is there in Mombasa and then now KRA ask for this, the other cabs ask for this. Uh -huh. um, then it has took so long, so demarrage is waiting for you. Uh -huh. The storage, uh -huh. because the storage is uh, demanded uh, every day you have uh -huh. to pay for storage uh -huh. of the container at uh -huh. the port. So if it takes like, I have a container which landed on February, uh -huh. up to date, uh -huh. it's not yet cleared. Uh -huh. So you can count every day, maybe it's around 4,000 or something. So you count from February to now, how much is that? So it's a lot of cash. Wow. How do you move from that? How do That's you why you, you, you saw the, the small traders uh -huh. having a strike because they were, they were like, these guys are demanding a lot. And, uh, uh -huh. Some of us, we don't understand what mm -hmm. is needed because now we don't know the cartel that is there. Mm -hmm. But me, I, I keep my faith. All right. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't talk much, but mm -hmm. I keep my faith. And you I tell my guy faith. who's doing clearance, you just sort it. I know we will get what we want. Wow. So sometimes they might hold your goods. Yeah. For no apparent or real reason, or they don't yeah, tell yeah, you yeah. the reason. But, if you're but doing, at the end of the day, you still have to pay. If do, yeah, if you're doing clean business, mm -hmm. you don't need to be afraid. God will see you through. If you're doing clean business, unless you're doing something that has shortcuts, then you should not be afraid. If, if, if you're doing business and you see like, you know, the, the country is corrupt and you don't have money to, to, to substitute on the corruption, no, mm -hmm. don't worry. You just keep on doing the good work. Uh -huh. Even if you'll be executed in one way or another, uh -huh. but just know that one day it will come to pass that you've succeeded. I love your faith, man. Yeah. And faith plays a huge role in whatever you're doing. What I say is that faith does not make things easy, it makes things possible. Makes things possible. Yeah. Yes, pastors do. So. <laughs> I love it so much. Yeah. I appreciate this so much. So you're a pastor at your local church uh, in Riru? Yeah, I, I, I Youth pastor. pastor young people. Uh -huh. Yeah. So you lead young people. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. but I'm too much in missions. Like too much in missions. Last week I was in Bungoma. Uh -huh. In invitations. Why do you get all the time to to do God's work and still do your importation business and still run a film company? When you mind God's business, God minds your business. All right. <laughs> so you will just relax. God will be working for you. Now that's why I have some people who are working. Uh -huh. So I'm just relaxed i just see through the papers what is mm -hmm. being done and all that i just manage uh -huh. but there is a, the, the the ceo that is god uh -huh. is in control of everything so you never call yourself the ceo yeah, yeah. So your I, ceo is the god. almighty yeah so i'm just there i just work out my things uh -huh. uh, the things that i'm too much interested in. because if you check on my background it's all about god uh -huh. he is the one who had uh, put it that act of having a talent in me that mm -hmm. raised all these things because mm -hmm. if it was was not music the mm -hmm. talent that i had in music uh -huh. maybe i would have not been here so, so i have to continue with music. even if i have all that money i uh -huh. have to continue with the assignment uh -huh. that is preaching the gospel preaching the gospel yes. even if it's not through the music yes. through the word itself yes one thing i'm interested in uh, not so many people are going to teach our kids uh, or the previous or the generation that is coming mm. uh, about enterprising mm. and entrepreneurship and doing it yourself mm. while you go out there on missions and preaching the word is mm. it something you try to instill in these kids as well you see like when you when you grow up when you're young you'll uh -huh. be asked what would you like to be when you grow up uh -huh. you will say and then after some years it you changes be asked, you, it will change yes it, it keeps on changing class yeah, three yeah, yeah, yeah. is always doctor pilot yeah uh, doctor pilot and which one uh, astronaut nurse soldier <laughs> so, <laughs> like me, I, wanted to be, I wanted to be a pilot you wanted to be a pilot <laughs> but now you can pay your own pilot if yes, you keep yes, on like yes, this yes. Uh -huh. sometimes i go with plane to minister uh -huh. Uh -huh. you see uh -huh. god's work mm -hmm. but 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 anyway, back back to the vanta <laughs> So I'm also like a pilot then. Mm -hmm. In the long run, and you're both yeah. fly. Yeah. But back to the matter. These kids, uh, when you're a kid, you say you want to be a pilot. You were telling me something about kids when they're growing up, uh, their, their ambitions change or their visions or their dreams change yeah, over time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's because... Um, like when you're done with the form four, uh -huh. you will find that 
young people run into music, dancing, and mm -hmm. that. They have not yet discovered their purpose. Mm -hmm. When you come to realize your purpose on earth, mm -hmm. you'll be in a position to identify your role, and mm -hmm. you'll be in a position to identify where you 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 will you will land. Mm -hmm. Like for example, if today I see like I have a, an idea of selling eggs, mm -hmm. I will go and start. Mm -hmm. But kidogo kidogo to shanga, kipata mungina meka ka branch up next. Uh -huh. Asi webo mpati authority. Uh -huh. Ameka ka branch. Kidogo kidogo ka branch kengine. Uh -huh. No na to branch to out na advance. Wo uh -huh. liko uza na kamkebe wa me kujana kaleka ka kitu ka migu. Uh -huh. So na discover if you still stay there, uh -huh. all your clients will go there because uh -huh. that one is a bit professional. It's packaged. So yeah. it's in time season, in seasons, things changes. Mm -hmm. Sita ishi apo, I started with the music. Mm -hmm. I, I, I I graduated to videography. Mm -hmm. Now I mean importations mm -hmm. because now competition in Akujeki was stiff. Uh -huh. eh, unapata wase wanakuja wanashe, wananunua ideas. Mm -hmm. But now you have to be very, very co consistent mm -hmm. and also have the courage because mm -hmm. like now the Coca-Cola company, there are people who have really tried to reach to that. Uh -huh. But now they can't because the person who had the vision in Coca-Cola, uh -huh. there are things that he never shared. Uh -huh. Sometimes it's good you stick with your ideas uh -huh. and not everybody you will tell. Uh -huh. Let until that you bear out that 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 empowerment until when you the have the bloom. Yes, uh -huh. when you have that key thing, let people come ask you where you started. But now also, vision. Let your vision has to grow another vision mm -hmm. up, up, up on that. You, so you add another vision uh -huh. in that vision. So you, you keep always on adding need to value. Go progressive. Yes, yes, progressively. Be very yes, progressive. Yes, you have to be consistent. Don't stick there. Yeah, yeah. When you're in comfort zone, that mm -hmm. is when people will come by passing you, by passing you. What wanna kupita tuna baki tu kopale. The, 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 the last thing you just to kia wewe kama ulikuwa kulikuwa top ten billionaires we uko twenty. <laughs> so, <laughs> so comfort yeah. is a true enemy yeah, yeah, yeah. of business yes, and entrepreneurship. Yes, yes. So you should never be comfortable. Yes. Progress. Yes, and there are two Always. things mm -hmm. that, that are in life. Mm -hmm. Failure is real mm -hmm. and uh, success is real. Mm -hmm. It all comes from you. Uh -huh. It's 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 real. Uh -huh. You can be a failure. You can be. It's your decision. It's you, you have the answers that you, you have. You just need to release yourself or mm -hmm. you press yourself. Mm -hmm. If you press yourself, you'll never come out. But if you release yourself into those places, you need to meet different kind of people. You need to learn. You need to have a role model. Mm -hmm. You need to have someone you can look upon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if today I come and I ask you, whom do you look upon? Mm -hmm. Nani, 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 nani who could inspire? interesting. Like now I have issues with these young people who are doing go music today. Uh -huh. When you ask them who is your role model, they will uh -huh. tell you someone. Uh -huh. But when you look at the life of that person that is their role model, and then you 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 find that these guys the things that they are doing they end up the same same thing because they are corrupt in a way. Because uh -huh. life is spiritual. Uh -huh. So whatever you like when you read the Bible when King Saul had those demons he mm -hmm. used to call King he used to call David to come and pray up mm -hmm. and when David could pray up the, mm -hmm. the, the, the demons could run away. Mm -hmm. That means that music is very spiritual. Mm -hmm. Sometimes whatever you listen can affect you. And even whatever you see, mm -hmm. we have the senses. Mm -hmm. It can affect you. So in most probably, if you keep on listening to motivation speakers, mm -hmm. you'll be motivated. If you keep on watching pornographies and all those things, mm -hmm. you'll be motivated to do the same. Mm -hmm. So it comes to with... To fornicate. Yes, and yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. So it depends with what you listen, your influence, mm -hmm. your influence, even your friends. It mm -hmm. depends. So keep a, a good bunch of friends around yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, feed yourself as much as you feed your mm -hmm. stomach well, feed your mind well, and feed your heart well. Yeah, in fact, it reached to a point whereby I could go to those. I was telling a friend of mine when I was coming, now I want to enroll to golf clubs. Mm -hmm. Because where the, these guys are playing golf, they are mm -hmm. rich people. Millionaires are there mm -hmm. with great and big ideas. Mm -hmm. And some of them, they have ideas, yes, but they are not implementing in terms of the young people who are growing, who are going to be entrepreneurs in mm -hmm. years to come. Mm -hmm. So if I go and m roll with them, uh -huh. I engage with them, uh -huh. I'll be able to learn what they want to achieve in uh -huh. life as they are. And now they got and to I'll where they are. Yes, and I'll be in a position to take myself back to my age uh -huh. and be in a position to execute it before I get old. So it, it depends with you. All right. Powerful words from a decent man right there. Yeah. Mr. Stevenson himself. Yeah.
as we wrap this up, how can they get to, how can they get to be part of your trading business? How can they buy or sell to you? How mm -hmm. can they get a hold of your services in videography? Your camera is number four. And don't forget YouTube as well. How can they get your music? Oh, my music <coughs> is on YouTube. That is Stevenson Music. Mm -hmm. On Facebook, you can get me at Stevenson Music. Uh, Stevenson Kenya, again, one is full. In Guinea, you space. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my friend request. Stevenson Music, I'm a Stevenson Kenya. And then I have uh, the, 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 the company mm -hmm. page, that is Unlimited Films. Mm -hmm. Again, I have a youth empowerment, I, I called a youth, a Unlimited Youth Empowerment, mm -hmm. whereby I nurture young people. I do motivational speakings in high schools, mm -hmm. and so in col colleges and all learning institutions. Mm -hmm. So uh, you can get me at Unlimited Films, you can in DM me there, and Instagram, that is Unlimited Films, and again, Stevenson music or Stevenson Kenya. Stevenson Kenya. Yeah, and I import as, I have a page on Facebook and I import as where I post my stuff when you I You post the products back. that they can buy yeah, yeah. at a very good price. Yes, yes. All right, uh, so the people who come to your Facebook and say, Nilikwana Y254, what about a discount maybe? Yeah, yeah. Tunaweza nego, linalingana ni nini unataka kununua? All right. So <laughs> if you more? show Stevenson on Y254, yeah. and it's a quite a good price when you go to NI Importers yes. on Facebook. Yes. This is a powerful gentleman right here. He has a powerful story. Mm -hmm. What is your last remarks uh, to the viewers since you're a public speaker? Yeah, yeah, yeah. As much as you're being raised by God, mm -hmm. or as much as you get what you what you are trying to get in life, mm -hmm. you should remain humble. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's humility. Humble, humility. Very important. This is what has take, taken for me to be here. Powerful. We have a question on Facebook. Mm -hmm. and this question is simple. We are just yeah. asking people mm -hmm. uh, what kind of, what business have they seen before or are they uh, engaging in uh, that is simple but still very interesting in terms of execution and the money it brings. Have you ever, what is this one business that you've seen around that is quite simple but very interesting and brings in some cash. Of course, I might talk about the talents uh -huh. because the talent is something that is very unique. That if you execute it in a good way, uh -huh. someone will see the it will have an interest on it. Mm -hmm. And uh, maybe you are doing like your portrait, your uh -huh. your drawing art uh -huh. that can but be just very making much, people yes, laugh. Maybe yes, yes, uh -huh. yes. Maybe you're a comedian. Uh -huh. I, I I have worked with the Sagu. Uh -huh. I have been a film director for the for the Sagu uh -huh. several times. Uh -huh. and, uh, I know that guy makes money very easy and mm -hmm. some other guys, they mm -hmm. make money very easy. Mm -hmm. So your talent can be the simplest way of making money. The talent, and it, yes. it can be from singing to yeah, yeah, yeah. comedy to writing to drawing yeah, as to I the told, simplest form. As I said, like, sometimes it's not good to copy what other people are doing. Mm -hmm. Everybody is best in his own way. Mm -hmm. So when you're copying someone, you're not real. Uh -huh. Just be real. Sometimes, if you if you if you're a Christian or if you ha you're a believer, uh -huh. you can tell God to help you or the Holy Spirit to guide you in what you can do, uh -huh. and He will definitely guide you. You'll find it. Yeah. Thank you very much, Mr. Stevenson, for coming through to buy in the morning. Yeah. We appreciate you. Keep your feedback coming our way as well, and you can interact with them at NI Importers on Facebook. That is a business page. Your personal yeah. again. Stevenson Kenya. Stevenson Kenya, you can interact and with Stevenson this. Music again. And Stevenson Music yeah. on YouTube and on social media. You can interact with him. He has a lot of powerful words to yeah. share with the people right there. I go by the sure. name of Barry Moses or it's by one of his social media platform. Alex is coming up next with another interview. And don't forget uh, to respond to our question on Facebook. Don't go nowhere.